great. Uh, so this is Fancy Free from the ballet. Mm -hmm. And um, I really like the style, and I love that you have, uh, your, you have the rhythmic distinction between the swung notes that are written out swung and then the straight notes. Within those, though, I think you can really use the slurs to give it, uh, even though it's not swung, you can give it some more rhythmic life. So instead of bum 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 bi bum yum uh yeah ba bi yum bi ya bum bi yum bi yum ba dum bum bum ba ba dum bi ba bum bum you know what I mean? So when there's a slur, really feel that as a big, like a rhythmic impulse point ba bi dum bi ba bum ba dum bi yum ba bi yum. Anytime there's a slur, imagine that there is a an impulse there. Can you try it slowly and just feel those impulses? Yes. 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 Right. Great. Um, now, can you try that slowly again? And on top of that, this is sort of based on, uh, well, uh, definitely influenced by stride piano. And stride piano is just this whole 515151. Five, uh, if you ever go and watch on YouTube the videos of people playing stride piano, it's like technically uh, awesome. Mm -hmm. um, they're, they're, I don't know how they do it, and they just have learned these enormous intervals. But um, that kind of rhythm, I think, if you use, if you pedal those as a slur, you lose sort of that impulse. Gunk, cha, boom, cha, boom, cha, boom. So maybe we'll try it slow, but to try to use no pedal and, or less pedal. Da, ti, tom, ti, tom, ti, tom, cha, tum, cha, mm, cha, yeah. Yeah, try, try, I'm gonna say no pedal and a little bit more bite to the ba, 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 ba. Ba, 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 yes. Ba. It's already much better. Can you just play the left hand? Go. Ba, ba. Yeah, I think the top note needs a little bit more life. Boom, ba, boom, ba, boom, ba. Really short. Right, so if you were playing in a band, what would be playing on two and four? The snare drum, right? It's bass. Try that. So it's really short and really, it's got some bite to it. Ba, ba, ba. much better. Um, the other thing you can throw in there is here, it's not Marco Legato, and you can so that you really distinguish between the long, long, so anytime there's that marking, right. you want to, not, it's not about bringing it with an accent, it's about feeling that as the, a new rhythmic impulse, mm -hmm. so that you really go, for example, but that it's not the dee da dee dum, but ba bottom, bottom, ba bottom. So the, the the you almost feel like the tonic accent keeps shifting all over the bar. Try that and really really feel like don't worry about the accuracy of your left hand right now because we're stride pianists. It can go a little bit brisker, but and we're we're gonna forgive any wrong notes and really just feel ba chu ba chi ka. So I think if you, um, you could probably even go farther, just feeling uh, the left hand, uh, look it up, 
Look up stride piano, stride piano left hand, and you'll kind of get an idea of what I'm talking about. It could probably, it could in certain uh, productions go a little faster, so just be prepared for that. Right. But you really want it to feel, uh, once you get all that rhythmic impulse, then you can actually make it feel lighter and easier. But to, first you have to build in that structure, and that's kind of what gives this sort of the, the dancey feel, you know, like they just, um, you, that you're listening to, uh, you know, a pianist maybe in the East Village or something like that. Mm -hmm. Great. <laughs>